Chapter 10, A Man's World. Hmm. とりあえずはね。ここだけの話。社長は随分前から腎臓をやられてんだ。このことは。社長の腕を落としたのはその頃敵対してた中国人マフィアともでね。もちろん落とし前は俺がつけといた。仇の話には聞こえねえな。昔のことだ。俺らはその頃まだ不動産屋でもない頃付きでさ。でもそれ以来
本当に手が動いてる。ここにいればまず安全のはずだ。きっちり筋を通せってことなんだろう。多分な。喂、喂天。日皇不動産到底怎么了？为什么那样的日本黑帮也要帮？我有我的理由。收了这里，他也没有。
この件については別に金を用意します私の顔に金をくれとでも書いてあるかじゃあ他に何が必要です言ってくださいやめなさい礼儀を忘れて交渉はできませんよ小田さん社長立花あんたもういいのか陳さんお騒がせしています小田さん陳さんは一度下した決断を変える方じゃありません私たちもアジア外にいる以上そのことをわきまえておくべきですここに桐生さんをかくまうことはできませんでも社長織田もういい事情はよく分かった俺はよそに行く帰る前にお茶を一杯どうだねそのくらいはここにいても構わんよ<笑>いえお気遣いなく陳さんがここまで堂島組を恐れているとは思っていませんでした風間のおやつさんも言ってた何年か前堂島組は外国人のしのぎを奪って大きくなったって聞いているその時かなりの血が流れたらしいああ俺たちはその頃まだカムロ町にいなかったそれで陳さんとの間に温度差があったようだいいんだ。俺はここを出る。また連絡してくれ。それなら、西公園で身を隠すのが良いかと。ここほど安全とは言いませんが。西公園ホームレスのたまり場になっています。あそこなら道島組もすぐに桐生さんを見つけられはしないでしょう。わかった。それにしても、今は逃げ回るので手一杯だな。空の一つぼの方はどうなってる持ち主を抑えるって話だったはずだええでもその話はまた後で西公園に行ったら今夜だけはそこでしのいでください明日 I feel like I've heard that before この寒空に野宿かかける言葉が見つかりませんふん<笑>ならあんたも一緒にどうだ<笑>今二人でいるのは目立ちますそれに私は明日のために少し準備がありますから準備なんだ<笑>大したことじゃありませんそっかそれじゃあ明日だなええそれではまたなんとか堂島組に見つからないように気をつけてくださいわかってるはいそもそも Then, right? That, that's what I should be doing, right? <laughs> Whisper. Yeah, fair enough. And Whisper Kings. Oh, that's closed. Oh, right, that's Liquidation. Okay. So that's Whisper. Might as well go. And check out on that side quest. Bye. Hmm. All right, that's the back order. There's quite a few, huh? Pretty sure it's this one. Mm. Yes, yeah, it's something to mother. Oi. 
Sachiko, shut down your bolo zero. Oh, well, well, well. I wonder who put you up to this. <laughs> huh. So you're Sachiko, the bolo zero, right? Yeah. Yes, I am Sachiko. Is there a problem with that? Yeah, a big one. They're forcing girls to work in your bolo zero. It's making some of them miserable. Mm. Miserable? They make a lot of money selling, selling used clothes. Huh? Why would that make them miserable? Daddy. What? The customers want what we offer, and we're not making any loss. Why shouldn't we do what we do? What if your parents were to find out about your grocery? Think of the pain they would feel. How could you be so cruel to bring up my parents? My parents are long gone. I have no one who would be hurt if they would do what they do. So my business doesn't present a problem for anyone. I, I didn't know that one. Psych, are you seriously that gullible? My parents are fine. Nine. What? You can't even see through a light that far fetched. We love getting schooled by a school kid. Big Mr. Adonna. Isn't that exactly what I mean by it? Hmm. Besides, if you're worried about hygiene, I'm only sitting back. Huh. What you're doing is selling yourself, you're fooling around in the world of adults. When kids play with fire, they're going to get warm. Oh, uh, well, well. I haven't gotten warmed yet. We'll see what happens when I die. We finished. Hello there. Uh. Oh, hello. Mm -hmm. May I help you? Mm -hmm. Sachiko chan. Oh, Sachiko chan. Oh, but these were so sweet, Sachiko chan. I, I'm glad to hear that. Will you come back for more? Sachiko chan, I love. <laughs> yeah. Sachiko chan, I love. Sachiko chan. Uh, um, you're freaking me out here. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna not. I I can't do that. Huh? <laughs> you you're really scaring me. Please, I can't. Uh. It's alright, you were safe now. Uh, uh. Huh? What the? You. Don't get in my way. Such a good chance. It should be easy. Yo, release. A eh, good amount of money at least. It doesn't even vocalize. Are you alright? I'm okay. I told you right. You played with fire and you got born. Uh, why do you help me? After all the horrible things I said to you. I will never just stand around while a high school girl got assaulted in front of me. That's... I don't... Uh, Sachiko chan. Mina. Uh, I'm sorry, but I can't do this anymore. I'm quitting your guru Seraku. I'm really sorry. Please, let her quit. I'm her boyfriend. And don't bully her for quitting your group. I hate to admit it, but you were totally right. The Burisera business is too risky again for high schoolers to be playing. 
I never even thought about a girl like Mina being in danger for something I put together. I'm going to disfront this Furo Serapis, right now. Uh, you are? Really? Mm. Yes, really. I'm sorry for everything, Mina. Yes, yes. Mina-chan, I don't have to sell my panties anymore. Awesome, Mina-chan. Thanks for being honest with me. Why is the session? You made their day too. Thanks. I just don't even want to be that frightened again. There's no need to thank me. Huh, got it. Besides, <laughs> I think you should only show your only word to someone you really care about. Oh, okay. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. Hit them. It's gonna go around. Oh. Hmm. Well, what's the police person anyway? Uh, fine. Oh, he's got a hammer. There we go. Untouchable. I also seem to be getting more money from combat. Oh. Another side story. <coughs> she looks so simple. No, maybe not. But still. Oh, she's gone. Maybe they said, but I could be wrong. What's that guy up to? Sugar daddy, huh? Mm. Is it her? Is it not? I can't tell. Oi, Oi. what are you? What are you up to? Uh -huh. What? Who are you? You startled me. Who am I? Doesn't matter. What do you think you're doing, spying on that girl? You'd better not be stalking her. St stalking her? Uh -huh. Oh, no, 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 nothing of the sort. I was just keeping an eye on the girl out of paternal instinct. Paternal instinct? Oh, she's your daughter. Mm. Well, that's where things get murky. I can't really be sure whether she's my daughter or not. Mm. What do you mean? Got it. So, you haven't seen your daughter in years? Yeah. Yes, it's been 15 years since my divorce, and my visitation rights were denied. That's a long time. Why did you get divorced? I hate to admit it, but the business I was running back then went under. My company was doing well, nothing spectacular, but it provided a steady income. But I got complacent and failed to see the market turn. When loss started to mount, I kept blowing borrowed money into the failing business, convinced I could turn it around. Eventually I found myself drowning in debt. My wife must have had enough of my obstinate pride. She walked out without a daughter, Natsume. Oh, I see. After that, I did anything I could to redeem myself. I took every job available and bought before anyone who would help. Thankfully, the one main economy lifted my fortunes. Now I earn enough money to live without any worry or want. What to hear? It was only now my wife and Natsume might be willing to give me another chance. But I have no way to contact them. Recently, I found a girl who is the spitting image of Natsumi when she was a child, but grown up. Ah, I see. So she's the hostess you were watching. Yes, exactly. Fifteen years ago, Natsumi was five years old. She should be around that girl's age now. If it's not too late, I want to see my girl Natsumi again. I want to talk with her and eat together like we used to. I want to kill daddy again, but the problem is I'm not sure if she really is my son or not. My dogs are keeping me from taking the next step. Yeah, you'll have my your daughter is a hostess, isn't she? Why don't 
you just cut off the glove and hacer in person. If you were to this, I wouldn't be suffering like this. Where the girl is my daughter or a stranger, I need to be emotionally prepared for the fallout. I can't do anything until I know for certain. Mm. Well, you'll never meet your daughter by doing nothing. I was hoping you could help with that. Can you go to her club and figure out whether or not she's my daughter? Me? Yeah. Yes. You understand the situation and you look to be a man familiar with these kinds of um, nighttime establishments. Of course, I'll put the glove charges. Just think of it as a free night out. Mm. Mm. Well. Please. Please let me see my daughter. He's not even sure if she's really his daughter. But he is hurt. And he's willing to pay for it. What should I? Sure, why not? Uh, fine, I'll do it. I'll check if she's your daughter. <laughs> you will? Thank you so much. Uh, I'm Kiryu. Ah, uh, Kiryu san. My name's M Misumi. Thanks again for your help. Please accept this. Money. The girl who looks like my daughter uses the name Reika at the club. Please use that money to recruit her uh, quester. Okay, got it. Thank you so much for doing this. It's nice to meet you. And that face is kinda <laughs> creepy. I'm Reika, thank you for coming today. Uh, sure. So, this is the girl who might think Misumi started. Because of she does kind of resemble Misumi. How does he know? Mm. Um, I'm sorry, have we met before? Uh, I don't know, no. This is the first time. My name's Kiryu. Oh, that's a relief. Please don't scare me like that, Kiryu-san. Mm. What's a relief? I didn't remember seeing your face, Kiryu-san. I got nervous because I thought maybe I forgot a returning guest's face. Oh, it's okay. We haven't met. Mm? Then, why did you request me? Daddy. Oh. You asked for me by name, so it must mean you knew about me, right? Where did you hear about me? Why did you request me? Mm. She's not going to get this one. I have to avoid making her suspicious. from a friend. He told me there's a real cute and charming girl named Reika at this club. Uh. Oh, I see. It makes me so happy to hear that. Who is your friend? I'd rather be extra nice when he comes again. Oh, um, well, he was just part of a big group. There were a lot of guys talking about Reika and how amazing she is. <laughs> oh, yes, oh, me. Yes, I've got a reputation to live up to. Good. Reika's feeling more motivated. Come to think about it, that doesn't really help me at all. Like, how long have you been doing this kind of work? Mm, not very long. I started as I turned 20 this last summer, so it would be around 6 months. And then... Yep. Kiryu san, what line of work are you in? I'm currently working in debt collection and real estate. Oh, you're quite versatile. Speaking of real estate, I'm thinking of moving. Maybe I can ask you for advice. You want to move? Yeah, my room is too small. I might be able to use this to find out more about me. How's your place like that? How's your place like that? I live in a tiny six one. One room apartment with a kitchen. You don't? The so one room isn't so bad if you live alone. That's true, but I live with my mother. Oh, you and your mother? How nice. We lived in the same apartment since I was a child. I'm starting to make a decent living, so I was thinking I wouldn't mind a bigger place. Ah, uh, I get it. Kind of like a reward for your hard work. <laughs> exactly, Kiryu-san. I couldn't agree more. If you hear about a good place for rent nearby, would you let me know? Uh, sure, I will. Maybe if I could get one more piece of idea and that points to Reika being me some stuff. Oh 
I'm not sure if I should be asking this, but I take it your father's not around. My father, to be honest, I don't remember him very well. You don't? No. My parents divorced when I was still small. My mother left him and took me with her. I never saw my father since. Now I can't even remember what he looked like. What caused her divorce? I think my father's business failed. I heard he was in a lot of debt to me. Yep. How long ago was that? How old were you? Mm. I was five at the time, so I think fifteen years ago. Five years old. Yep, that's how that's it. Reka is my son is older. She's not so. Kira san, why are you asking me these things? It's like the not the moon. Reka, there's someone I want you to meet. Huh? Yeah. Your father. M my father? But how? Would you come with me? Just trust me. Okay. Yeah, that would be one hell of a... <laughs> a news flash, I guess? Still having trouble with war sometimes. My father is really here in Kamurochi. Uh, yeah, he's been hoping to see you for a long time. So, where is he? He should be somewhere around here. There he is. Oi. Hi, I brought your daughter. Kiryu-san, is, is my daughter really there? Uh, yeah, let her see your face. Father? I... I can't. I can't see my daughter. What? I, I'm too ashamed to face her. I'm sorry, Kiryu-san. After I asked you to help me, and you even brought my daughter to me. But I can't. Father, it's okay. It doesn't matter anymore. Please, look at me. I don't remember very much. But let's talk like we used to when I was little. Marika had to beg to leave the group for this. You go to her to at least let her get a good look at you. Curious son. I was refusing to face reality again. This is like 15 years ago, when I turned a blind eye to my business stone, sank into the earth and paid for it with my family. But I'm not going to run anymore. I'm going to face reality. I'm going to see my daughter. Hello, Natsumi. Huh? Um, who's Natsumi? Daddy. Oh. Um, you're Natsumi, right? Alright, quick. Pardon, isn't Rika just a stage name you use at the club? No, it's my real name. <laughs> Wait, what now? So that means you're not my daughter? But... I thought that was that's <sighs> funny. <sighs> it wouldn't be that easy, huh? Or that simple, or whatever. Our backgrounds are so similar, Misumisan. It's almost like fight or something that we met. Right. Strange word true. Hey, Kachan, you look just like my daughter. I see her in me. What she looked like when she was five isn't anything to go on, though. Misumisan, you're so silly. <laughs> I couldn't find my own daughter, but I got to know you, Rikasan. This is even better. <laughs> Oi. Hey, Misumi, is this what you wanted? Hey. No worries, Kirusan. What's life if you can't enjoy it? <laughs> oh, this is for the trouble I put you through. Oh, wait, I bring the most expensive drink you have to rake a chan over here. Yay, thank you, Miss Omisa. Oh, stop it. I forbid you to call me anything so, for, so formal as Miss Omisa. Daddy, call me Daddy. Why, call you whatever you like, Daddy. <laughs> Say that again, please, once more. Daddy. Wait there, bring us a fruit plate there, quick. Uh, there's more than one kind of daddy, I guess. <laughs> well then. I could have name for the story, at least. I think it's a good time for me to go find a payphone and... I'll probably do some real estate in between. Maybe, I'm not sure. Oh, there's a side point. Perfect. 
fact, isn't this exactly where I started today's live stream? Maybe. Oh well. Anyway, I hope you all had fun, and I'll see you next time. Bye!